Ciao! Today is a very special day because today is the day we're going to make a lasagna. <laughs> we're going to make a lasagna and it's a very special, very special day because today, hold, hold on. Today, today is the day that the Sylvester Stallone thought of the character Rocky. I mean Rambo. So what we're going to do is we're going to make a lasagna for the whole of family. Come here, come here, Giuseppe, come here, come here. This is my two sons. This is Giuseppe in the green shirt. And this is Luigi, he's over here in the white shirt. And we're gonna have a good time, are we gonna celebrate? We're gonna teach everybody how to make a lasagna? You want to teach them how to make a lasagna? Huh? Okay, so we're gonna teach them how to make a lasagna. First thing you got to do is you got to get the lasagna. Oh, the camera's on. Why didn't you tell me? What I was going to show you is I was going to show you how to put the fresh basil in the salsa. What you do is you go down to the local market. You get to the nicest, the nicest fresh basil that you can find. And you make sure there's a lot of, a lot of fresh basil on top of the tree here. And you peel it. You just pull it. Nice and easy. And what you're going to do with that basil is you're going to take it and you're going to throw it in the salsa. Gently cut it up, clean it just a little bit of water, and then you throw it in the sauce and it tastes delicious. Okay, so we're back and we're going to make a lasagna. The first thing that you need is you need the, the, the noodles, the lasagna noodles. You need the cheese, fresh mozzarella, fresh mozzarella. Mwah! Magnifico. You want the mozzarella, Luigi? Mario, you want the, you want the little chicken? No? Okay, so we put a little of the sauce in the pan. Let me see. You see the sauce in the pan? Okay, we got a little sauce in the pan. And now what we need is a very carefully. You got to take the noodles, take them nice and flabby, and you gently put them, gently put them on, on the plate there. It's a nice lasagna pan. Okay, cooking it. Once you get the first layer of noodles, then it's very important. Watch it. What you got to do is. You got to get a fresh regatta. Fresh regatta from the store. Fresh regatta. You put a little parsley, a little cheese, a little Parmesan cheese, a little salt and pepper, garlic powder, and then one egg. Not two eggs, just one egg. Gently put the, the regatta fresh on the pan. This is a Luigi's favorite meal. Right, Luigi? So after you put a nice rogotta on top of the lasagna, very, very nice. Then what you got to do, you take a nice, a fresh a can of corn. And then the people ask me, what do you need a corn for? You make a lasagna. <laughs> Absolutely nothing. So now that you got the fresh rogotta on the pan, now it's time to put it. Fresh mozzarella, fresh mozzarella. So now that you got the ricotta and the fresh mozzarella in the pan, now it's time to add some sauce. Now the thing is you got to get this sauce cooking at about 7.30 in the morning. 7.30. And you let it cook all the day. So now that you got the ricotta, the mozzarella, and a fresh layer of salsa, now it's time to put another layer of the noodles. Now on a normal day, I would have put a little bit of Parmesan cheese in between. But my beautiful wife Isabella, she forgot to buy the Parmesan cheese. And then we need one more layer of noodles. One more layer of noodles. That's all we need is just a one more layer. Isabella! 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 Isabella's upstairs and doing laundry. Okay, so we're back. We got the nice lasagna. It's coming out nice and fresh. And I got my little son here, Luigi. Giuseppe.
Sometimes the kids, they take the noodles and they start slapping each other in the face with the noodles. We have a little bit of fun here. They take the noodles and they have nothing to do with so they start slapping each other in the face. They slap each other in the face with the noodles. Here, go on boys, play. Slap each other in the face with the noodles. Go slap each other in the face. Okay, okay, we're back. No more fighting. No more fighting, boy. No more fighting. No more fighting. That's enough. And then pick the noodles up. You made a mess. Look at what you did. You made a mess. You gotta pick the noodles up and throw them in the carpet. Okay, now that we got the no more rogata, no more rogata, it's all gone. So what you do is you go ahead with the sink. Isabella come and she come and clean the dishes in just a little bit. That's okay. Fresh your sauce on I top of the pan. I still got this, Dad! Ooh, magnifico. Dad! I still got this! And we eat Look! Mm. Dad! 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 Luigi, hey, be quiet for one minute. Be quiet for one minute, Daddy! Be quiet for one minute. We got the people here. We're teaching them how to make a lasagna. I said on this. Throw it in Daddy. the garbage. It's okay. Daddy. delicious that lasagna looks. Yeah. So now what we're going to do is we're going to turn the stove on the oven to about 375 degrees. 375, not a bit higher. Put it in the oven for about a good, four, I'd say 45 minutes. 45 minutes or so. We put it in the oven and it's going to be nice and crisp, nice and moon, magnifico. Mwah. Oh, and after a nice day of fresh cooking, you sit down on your nice Italian leather sofa and I make sure, very important, very important, make sure you put a nice plastic on top of the couches because the kids, you know, they come in here and they want to play and the next thing you know, they're eating the spumoni on top of the couch and the, the cannolis and you got powdered sugar everywhere and it just kind of ruins the couch. This way, you can pass on the couch from generation to generation. You see, this couch that used to be my great-grandmother's and it's shipped it here all the way from Italy, it hit Ellis Island, and I'm very proud of this, a nice Atlanta couch. Sit back and then you relax for about, uh, you know, 35, 40 minutes, and then you've got the great lasagna. You can invite over the neighbors, you know, the Castatolis, you can invite over the people across the street, uh, nah, they're Polish. But uh, anyway, maybe they come over, maybe they like it, you know, you never know. Polish people, maybe they like Italian lasagna, hey, you never know. Hey Isabella! Isabella! Why don't you call over the Polish people, see if they want the lasagna? And then we sit down as a nice family. I got Isabella, I got the Giuseppe, and I got the, my other little boy over there. We're gonna sit down and we're gonna eat. What's your name? Tell them your name. It's a Luigi. Luigi. We're gonna sit down and we're gonna taste this uh, delicious lasagna. Mm. Magnifico, huh, Luigi? You like it? You like it? Yeah, my beautiful wife Isabella, gonna make a nicer plate to bring over to the nicer Polish family across the street, huh? Maybe they like a, a lasagna, you never know. What do you think, Isabella? Yeah, maybe, I don't know. Huh? The nice Polish family, they know. They just moved in the neighborhood. We're gonna make them a nice little plate and we're gonna bring it over there and see if they like it. She's gonna bring it over to the nice Polish people. It's a pouring rain, but that's okay. Because of the Polish people, they appreciate the nice Italian lasagna. Ciao for now.